Happy Sabbath, boys and girls. I'm so excited to see you again for Sabbath school. Look, I'm here with my dog. Do you have a pet at home? Do your pets come to Sabbath school too? My dog likes to sit for church and Sabbath school. Did you bring your instruments? We're gonna sing and praise Jesus today. That's right, run and get them if you forgot them. I'm so excited to see all of you. And do you know what? I bet you know your memory verse really good today. Our memory verse is Jesus was obedient. Luke 2.52. Jesus was obedient. Luke 2.52. Is that a good job, Cassie? Yeah? Oh, she says you did a good job. You should get yourself a sticker. Yeah. Here's a sticker. I'm going to put it on my hand. Jesus was obedient. Luke 2.52. Great job, boys and girls. See you soon. Where we give praise to Jesus, and it's such a wonderful day because it's Sabbath. So let's find someone to hug and let's sing. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. How are you today? Good morning to you. Good morning to you. This happy Sabbath day. Good morning, boys and girls. The Bible says, children. Obey your parents in the Lord, for this is right. O B E Y, obey your mom and dad. O B E Y, it makes them very glad. Listen to what words they say. Obey your parents every day. O B E Y. Obey your mom and dad. O B E Y. Obey your mom and dad. O B E Y. It makes them very glad. Listen to what words they say. Obey your parents every day. O B E Y. Obey your mom and dad. O B E why obey your mom and dad o b e y it makes them very glad listen to what words they say obey your parents every day o b e y obey your mom and dad it makes jesus very happy too Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. Doing exactly as the Lord commands, doing it happily. Ooh wee! Action is the key, do it immediately. Joy you will receive. Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. O B E D. I E N C E. Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. Doing exactly as the Lord commands, doing it happily. Ooh, wee! Action is the key, do it immediately. Joy you will receive. Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. O B E D I E N C E. Obedience is the very best way to show that you believe. It's time for our missionary song. The boat. Go sailing to the mission land, sailing, sailing mission boat. It takes the Bible to the children there, sailing missionary boat. The plane goes flying to the mission land, 
flying, flying mission plane. It takes the pastor to the children's air, flying missionary plane. The car goes driving to the mission land. Vroom, vroom, mission car. It takes the teachers to the children there. Vroom, vroom, missionary car. Beep, beep. Hi, boys and girls. We're the Missionary Kids. We tell stories of God's love and power. Our story for today is called A New Girl. I hope you find the special letter of the day. Our story for today is about a girl named Sophia who lived in the country of Ukraine. Sophia attended a public school in Ukraine and had a lot of fun, especially with her best friend, Vernica. But one day, she and Vernica had a terrible fight. Vernica said very mean things to Sophia. Nobody needs you. You will never have any friends, Vernica said. And then she pushed Sophia hard. Sophia fell down and hit her head. Sophia didn't cry at first, but when she went home and thought about Vernica's hurtful words, she cried. Her mom tried to comfort her. After some time, news came that there was a new school in town, an Adventist school. Sophia's mom asked her if she would like to attend. Sophia gladly said yes. But even at the new school, she was still sad because she kept thinking about Vernica's hurtful words. The teacher noticed and asked Sophia what was the problem. Sophia told the teacher what had happened. And the teacher explained to Sophia about how much Jesus loves each one of us and how Jesus forgave those who hurt him. And teacher encouraged Sophia to do the same. Sophia started reading her Bible and learning more about Jesus' love for her and how Jesus forgives all of us. Sophia decided to forgive Vernica and at that moment she became a new person. She decided to share God's love with everyone she knew. She even preached a sermon at school. Boys and girls, that was another wonderful story of God's love and power. And it was wonderful to see the transformation that happened when Sophia decided to, oh, how about this? I'll ask you, did you catch the special letter of the day, boys and girls? Did you say the letter F? That is correct. F reminds us to forgive. When Sophia learned about how God forgave us, she decided to then forgive Vernica. And when she forgave Vernica, she started a whole new life and she became a brand new person. Our Heavenly Father wants the same for you and I. So we can go ahead and ask him to help us to forgive when someone has done something very mean or hurtful to us. Well, boys and girls, that's all we have for today. Remember, you too can be missionary kids. All you have to do is share stories of God's love and power. Bye-bye. <laughs> everybody let's discover more about our heavenly father through nature's wonder oh what a beautiful nice flower i really like red flowers they look so beautiful and i like how they open up and bloom so precious but this one is closing up what's happening flowers don't last forever after they bloom, they close up. Yeah, I wish they lasted forever. I know of one thing that lasts forever. Do you know what it is? The Bible? Yes, it's the Bible. The Bible lasts forever. Isaiah 40 verse 8. The grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of our God stands forever. That's right. We can always trust the Bible. It never changes, and it'll never fade away like the grass or the flowers. And that's our Nature Wonder for today. Bye-bye.
Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to Cradle of All Sabbath School. The memory verse is Luke 2 51. Good job. And the story is Little Jesus the Happy Helper. Yes, Little Jesus the Happy Helper. And you know what, boys and girls? Our memory verse is Jesus was obedient. Luke 2, 51. Let us say it together. Jesus was obedient. Luke 2, 51. Good job, boys and girls. Do you remember the, the message? I obey and help others. Yes, we obey and help others. And you remember the first week, Jesus helped with the broom. He helped sweep. Yes. And good. And do you remember how our roof was? And JT and his daddy helped to fix the roof. Boys and girls, come in with us. Come in. Come in. Let us show you something. Do you help in making up your bed? You see how Jesus rolled up his bed? I know you do not sleep on a bed like that. You have nice bed. And you see how he fixed his book? And look, look. You see what he did? Look, boys and girls. And look at the toys. He put things away. But you are going to see a real room. But before we go, we are going to say a prayer and we are going to do a finger play. I like to help. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Good. Pray when you wake up in the morning. Pray at the table too. Pray before closing your eyes to sleep. Pray in all that you do. So boys and girls, everything that you do, you must pray. Boys and girls, do you love to help? Do you love, do you have helping hands? Yes, helping hands. Boys and girls, look, look at this. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Are you ready? Come on. We are going to pretend that we are sweeping. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Daddy, help me sweep. Wash, wash, wash. Mommy, help me wash. Dust, dust, dust. Daddy, help me dust. Vacuum, vacuum, vacuum. Mommy, help me vacuum. I like to help mommy. I like to help daddy. I like to help Jesus. Boys and girls, do you love to help? Yes, we must love helping. And you know what? Did you wash your hands this morning? So very clean and tan? And lend them both to Jesus? To work for him till what? I wash my hands this morning so very clean and tan and lend them both to Jesus to work for him till night. Little hands be careful what you do all day. Anything for Jesus only let me do. Boys and girls, you're going to see how JT help at home. Hello, boys and girls. Come on, come on. You're going to see a real room. I know your room is something like this. Oh, my goodness. This room is not in order. Oh, no. JT. Oh, no, boys and girls. Do your room look like that? You have helping hands? that you could help jetty we have a job to do we have to clean up okay we have to clean up 
Okay, good job, JT. Put the toys away. Let's clean up, clean up. Everybody, everywhere. Clean up, clean up. It goes right here. We're gonna turn it off for now because it's clean up time. And let's take it. Let's come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's put it right here. Good job, JT. Good job. Look, you have something else to pick up. Okay, come on, pick I'm it up. Out. Go, oh, your remote? Okay, put it right there. Good job, JT. Good job, good job, boys and girls. Do you help mommy like that? Oh, let's put that down there. And put this right there. Put the next one right there. Good job. Good job, boys and girls. You put away your toys like that. Let's put it up here. So you can find it. Okay, come on, come on. JT, you did not. Oh, boys and girls, oh, we have to come. Uh, are you going to help JT make up his bed? Okay, come on, JT, you go over there. Go over there. Auntie's going to help you. You want to fix the pillow first? Sure. Good, good job. Oh, my. Good job. Good job. Wow. Well, you want us to turn it down like this so you could go yeah. under? Yeah. Oh, Good job, boy. Good job. Oh, are you pulling it? Yes. Okay. You want me to help you? Okay. Oh, you did a good job. Good job, JT. Good job. Oh, JT. JT, look. What? Oh, that is so nice. Okay. Let me see. Good job. Good. JT, while your dirty clothes is there, can you please help me pick up your dirty clothes and put it in the hamper? I wear them already. Okay, they're dirty. Boys and girls, do you help mommy in putting away your dirty clothes? You wear them and they're dirty, but they're on the... You need some help? Okay. Good. Put them in. Good job. Good job. Whoa. Good job. Um, let, let's look, look. Oh, what about the box? Good job, J. Wow. Good job, boys and girls. Do you put away your books after you finish reading them? Good. Jenny, you have helping hands, just like Jesus. And you have helping hands. Look around in the room. Is there anything else that you need to fix? Oh, go get it! Good job! Clean up, clean up, everybody, and JT, you did a good job! Can I give you a high five? Yay! Yay! Good job! Boys and girls, you are a happy helper. You have helping hands, just like JT! He has helping hands! Until next time, we say bye, boys and girls. And remember, Jesus was obedient. Yes, and you are obedient too. Luke 2, 51. Jesus love you and we love you too. Bye. That was a great Sabbath school, boys and girls. Did you love the story? And the missionary kids? I did. Did you know what? It's time for us to sing our prayer song now. Cassie doesn't know how to close her eyes, but we can close ours. When it's time to pray, we bend our knees, fold our hands, close our eyes. When it's time to pray, we do these things. Then we talk to Jesus. Dear Jesus, thank you for Sabbath school. Thank you for our pets and for our families. We love you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye, boys and girls. We love you. We can't wait to see you. Goodbye, goodbye to you. 
Goodbye, goodbye to you Until another Sabbath We'll say goodbye to you Bye-bye Bye, -bye. Bye.